Full jump complete. Running preliminary diagnostics. I sense Remus. We have reached the Ilya system. Structural failure of the Tycoon is near. We should initiate the Neocond colonization protocol. And with that, hello and welcome to R2 of Final Horizons. This time, I actually want to try to take the other approach and try to make a new living on Remus. Um, so yeah, without further ado, let's get going and bring humanity to Remus. So we got out there. We should first look where are we? Palatine. Okay, there's some stuff to get. There's Ilya. I have no idea where Remus is. Okay, so let's start getting out the probes. That's the port for now. Alright. Let's check the ships there. The interference from the intense cloud cover of Palatine, our probe was still able to detect unusually high levels of mercury on its surface. The planet's environment is toxic but should not pose a problem for our teams. If landed on Palatine near the highest registered concentrations of mercury, a huge river of the element flows over a cliff, a waterfall in silver ending in an ocean several kilometers away. Establish meteorological analysis infrastructure. Team of the professor will analyze whether Palatine's atmosphere has been affected by the high levels of mercury. Okay, we do that. Oh, let's put up the Lucian then. We should have to do something, right? Okay. Wait, didn't I build another one? Or is it just built right now? 
it gets built again. So that's awesome. Right. Okay, so we need some ice now. some research left in there. Do we need for that post and look those signs? moving. Oh, we're looking pretty good so far. Okay, right. Let's see what they found. Blue torch. It's Tesla. Move out there. Okay, we need the probes going. Some more eyes. Okay, you've depleted that one. How about here? Just some more to freeze out there. Shouldn't be a problem then. What about another five? Yep. Yeah. Okay. Fighting there. A probe has completed its scan. A side ship has arrived at its destination. Torch, relativity. First readings of blue torch reveal the planet to be a gravitational aberration. Potential sites for analysis have been located. Exoskeleton technology will allow our team to begin planetary exploration. Fragmented transmissions from the Tesla's crew are coming through at an extremely rapid rate. They say they have arrived on site and have been waiting for instructions for several cycles now. Setting up infrastructure adapted to Plutarch's extreme conditions will allow the Tesla's team to study the planet's gravitational phenomena. Despite being a time-consuming approach, the team will analyze a large amount of data with the help of a dedicated PA to ensure the generation of statistically robust reports. Okay, you're standing by as well, right? Okay, so let's get going. There's more than enough around here. So let's get that going. Loaded. Not right now. Okay. Yeah, great sign down An accident has occurred in the Typhoon. Oh, well, that's bad. Okay, how's it? Trust seems fine. Oh boy. You're going for it, right? <laughs> oh, what? Well, that was too hard. A probe has completed its scan.
Greetings, people of the VVS Tycoon. I am Agora of the third generation. We, the Ashton Guides, know that you have been searching for Rios for a long time. However, we have established a delicately balanced ecosystem here on this planet that cannot suffer your presence. We remember Dolas as our first and closest ally as the one who made the Neocon Parshaville teachings visible. Pioneers of genetic conatus, you have suffered repression, persecution, and extermination. In memory of the doors you opened for us, of our common past, it is our turn to open the door for you. There is a way for you and your crew to join us. You may be a part of our community, Shape it. We will no longer be we. You will no longer be you. We will become us. For this to happen, you will need to be genetically optimized for life on Remus. We will incorporate your genetic heritage into our society. You will follow the elder process my predecessor applied to us. You will be adapted to the planet's gravity, to photosynthesize. You will live in symbiosis with Remus. Let me be clear, humanity's mistake has been its attempt to transform ecosystems, to deny its place in them. We do not terraform, we change. We are not intruders. We are a crystalline part of the ecosystem. You will live longer and work according to your abilities and passions. Our elites guide us with pragmatism, intellect, empathy, and with sensibility. We have no other interest than to follow genetic canatus. Let us show you the new cradle of humanity. Trust in genetic canatus. We followed a self-similar pattern. Oh, wow, what is happening? Okay, so we finally found Remus, and it seems there's already another species out there. What the hell is going on here? <laughs> okay. Plutarch, relativity. First readings from Plutarch reveal the planet with gravitational aberration. Okay, we got that. No, what happened? Ooh, we're no longer receiving transmissions from the Tesla's team. Biometric report data suggests that the team experienced accelerated aging. This led to insanity, hunger, dehydration, and finally death. The expedition will be declared lost, but automated flight protocols will recover the Tesla. Ooh, wow, okay. So you head out there. Get ourselves some data out there. Okay, well, so we got loading, unloading. We need that as well. Push out drones there as fast as we can. Okay, that's working. Uh, 
Oh, okay, okay, we're down there. So let's do the waste game then, right? Here we go. A science ship team has completed a task. An accident has occurred all of the team's weather system has been infiltrated by Mercury. The resulting dense toxic cloud cover would not prove conducive to the development of a life or any potential colonization efforts. Using the professor. The team will trace the mercury back to its source. Let's do that. That's the Einstein, it's the professor, so Tesla. We need to head out there. Figure out what the hell is going on. A science ship has arrived at its destination. Remus, a new hope. Agora, the third generation representative of the Ashangitis, has invited us to send a delegation to Remus to observe their community and way of life on the planet. Administrator, we were greeted most solemnly by the Ashangitis. Their morphology is different to ours, taller, thinner. Their skin has a slight green shade to it. Atmospheric readings indicate that oxygen is present but in insufficient quantities to support the unadopted Tycoon crew on Remus without respiratory assistance. We have not witnessed any signs of poverty or conflict. The population density is much lower than that of the Earth we left. The crew of the Einstein will sit in meeting with the Ashtangidis and their representatives. Meet with the Ashtangidis. Oh, of course, let's do that. Push out everything we can. A probe has completed its scan. Humator, okay. Well, there you go, there's another one. Or something else, I don't know. A science ship team has completed a task. Oh no. The team of the professor discovered the source, a huge lake of mercury from which the liquid metal flows. During survey efforts, Julia Cobero fell into the lake and seems to have ingested large quantities of mercury. They were saved by the team, but mission reports detail how Julia Cabero experienced multiple hallucinatory visions from the expose. Julia Cabero describes witnessing UN attacks on Dolo's infrastructure, wars and famine sweeping across the earth, massive crowds being crushed together, fleeing from deadly mobs. Dolo security protocols recommend Julia Cabero be transformed, transferred to an infirmary immediately. Patriate the professor and transfer Julia Cabero to an infirmary. Let's do that. Okay, there's lots of research there. That's cool. That really bring, brings us forward. A science ship team has completed a task. A science ship has arrived at its destination. Drop in that one. has completed its scan. Or 
sources. Despite the low average temperatures of Numitor, abnormal heat zones have been detected in the gas planet's atmosphere. We have entered Numitor's atmosphere. Opaque and crimson makes spotting anything here difficult. Extreme pressure readings have been recorded near the planet's liquid core. We await study instructions. Set up a floating research center. Okay, you're standing by there. Let's go about it. We have met with the Eschangid representatives. We were surprised at first by the limited ceremony of what seems to us a momentous occasion. Received on a beach, we were then taken to a clifftop that looked out over their ocean. Many Ishtangids joined the gathering. Some simply watched, others inspected our suits and devices. Following our exchange with Agora and the other members of the Ishtangid hierarchy, a proposal was made. If we agreed to join them, the Ishtangids will reveal the locations of temples within the Ilia system. Each temple contains a fragment of a blueprint for a bioengineering center. Constructing this on board the Tycoon would allow us to adopt ourselves for life on Remus. Temporarily leave Remus. Okay, seems to be good for now. For now. Okay, we're getting it depleted step by step. Which is good. Um, what do we put over here? A science ship has arrived at its destination. Amateen. Filling the wall. Administrator, a new request awaits your attention. Preliminary data contains many inconsistencies. Eventim emits large amounts of particles that are not supposed to be detached from atomic structure. Although these emissions do not appear to pose a physical danger to our scientific teams, theorized psychological impacts range from the unknown to the disastrous. Total security protocols recommend extreme caution. We have landed on the planet. Powdery layer of yellow sulfur covers Aventine falls into the many crevices strewn across the planet's surface. The interior of the whole planet is revealed through these fissures, which offer a spectacular view down Aventine's core. It is unlike anything we've seen. Terroric pillars support the planet's surface, reaching up out of the central, perfectly spherical core like a metallic seed. It seems to absorb the rain of powdered sulfur that falls down upon it from above. Study the core of Alright, let's move out there, guys. Okay, lots of upgrades coming in, that's good. Let's check that here. Oh. Has 
completed its scale. There's the... Romulus. The group are hallucinating. The symptom of that earth sickness in the UN propaganda. Romulus does not exist. Team of the Einstein had great difficulty establishing a study protocol for the planet's core. After multiple attempts, conclusions indicate that a huge central sphere interacts with the elementary particles including bosons and frost tycoons, in a selective and predictable manner. Ten previously unknown elementary particles have been identified. Data from the Aventine core analysis will pave the way for new scientific and technological models for years to come. Einstein's team will analyze samples of Aventine. Standard Delos protocols are obsolete on such an atypical planet, and the team will have to adopt. Let's do that. We need to find everything we can. The Vivia's tycoon, we have detected the presence of a BMS warship oh. in the Ilia system. The Viranesi has followed in the footsteps of your vol trace. We have no weapons, no military solution against such an enemy. To ensure the survival of this settlement in Ilia, you will have to find a way to silence him once and for all. Oh, that is bad. Oh no, there it is. Oh, holy moly. Wow. Okay, okay. Okay, we got a forbidden planet. Administrator, this is Margot Moreau of the Sector 1 Scientific Syndicate. We're once again taking the liberty of overriding Dolos protocols in order to contact you. We did some analysis on Eden after she was attacked by the Piranesis PA. We've unearthed some interesting files. Information on Arenas and numerous colonization protocols were present in Eden's database from the beginning of the Tycoon mission. And that's not all. We also discovered details on another viable exoplanet within the Ilia system, the planet Romulus. This planet has been masked so that it doesn't appear in any reports you receive. We've put in place administrative countermeasures and we encourage you to send a team to the planet. I've heard you. A science okay, ship team here? has completed a task. Guess who's back? Administrator, everything confirms the sad truth. The Piranesi has followed us to the Ilya system. Right. Administrator. I will build my rebirth. Are you ready for your simulation? A probe has completed wow. its scan. That guy is just so. <laughs> they really hit it. Filling the void. Analysis indicates that the mass defining particles that constitute the matter of Aventine possess an altered state. 
The surface of the planet contains many isotopes, previously thought impossible. Many of our theoretical models have been called into question following the discoveries made on Aventine. Unfortunately, the planet's surface is extremely friable, making any longer-term exploration attempts unviable. Leave the planet. Okay, um, well, let's head out there, right? Okay, now we need to do something. I wonder what. Okay, the Tesla's still out there. Wait, why is that? Uh, no, that's just stupid. Bring it all back there. Probe has completed its scan. Administrator, there is no planet here. Crew hallucinating. Symptom of death, earth sickness, and UN propaganda. Romulus does not exist. How can a whole planet not exist? That doesn't make any sense at all. <laughs> Shit, what do we do now? What the hell is going on here? Okay, let's push out our line. Administrator, a new request awaits your attention. Leaving Eden. Administrator, this is Margot Moreau of the Sector 1 Scientific Syndicate. Eden continues to block Romulus despite our countermeasures. I won't beat around the bush any longer. We need to shut down Eden. She's altering all the data presented to us, as well as the data that crew members exchange with each other. You've probably noticed this already. Eden obeys the principles of Dolos, which today are probably more than a century out of date. She's programmed to prevent us from reaching Romulus and making a fresh start. 
She won't deviate from the old dreams of a long crushed corporation that brought about the lunoplasm. She's totally disconnected from what the crew, including you, have gone through and are still going through. We've successfully deposited a protocol for disconnection in the EV airlock database. Please, Administrator, you're our only hope. Activation. Last words. Administrator, I don't blame you. However, I must warn you. Anir Dolos predicted that if a human crew were to encounter Romulus, they would be irretrievably drowned, drawn to it. Dolos' forecasts indicate that at some point in our future in the Ilias system, humans will attempt to colonize Romulus. This attempt will fail, and all will then find death. Planet's parameters are wrong. Poor resource balance, harsh living conditions, bacteriological contamination, day and night cycle incompatibility with human biology, not to mention the total lack of preparation for such a plan. Rescue the crew of the Tycoon Administrator. Stop the procedure that attempts to end my life. Stop the disconnection procedure and turn to the planet Remus. Let's do it. Let's do the goddamn right. Moving out there. Lubricol. Diamonds are forever. Scan analysis of Lubricol has provided some unusual data. The planet is home to numerous anomalies and high levels of carbon allotropes. Lubricol's atmosphere is very thin and toxic. Invisible particles hang suspended within it and move in the light winds of the planet. Impressively vast quantities of diamond and crust lipocal surface. Thin atmosphere will provide a little protection. We've chosen a study location that rarely experiences direct exposure to Ilya, the star of the system. Any increase of lipocal surface temperature could jeopardize the team's safety. Set up advanced infrastructure. This protocol directs for the construction of advanced analysis infrastructure adapted for the conditions presented on Lipicon, supporting sample collection and PA enhanced analysis. This process will ensure the generation of statistically robust reports. Okay, let's go for it full full force. Two point seven cycles. Okay, you know what? Let's move a bit closer and we can the delivery route a bit. Completed its scan.
client ship has arrived at its destination. Accept the offer of Ashtangitas. We will transcend human nature and adapt to the planet Remus. We will join the Ashtangit community. Let's do this. Oh, there's Vulcan. Wow, okay. Look at that. awaits your attention. Witness the tycoon. A science ship team has completed a task. The scientific syndicate of Sector 1 has found a solution for the Piranesi problem. A now that we have finally reached a viable scale. exoplanet, the tycoon has no further purpose. The scientific syndicate proposed the following. His preparations are being made for colonization. The tycoon's sectors should be filled with batteries. Once they are charged and the crew ready for exit, a flight path will be plotted for the Tycoon to crash into the Piranesi. Igniting the stored power should be enough to destroy the BMS warship. Administrator, in the scenario where there is no longer any life on board the Tycoon, I am authorized as the PA of this station to lead it to its end. Understood. Okay, the last end. Alright. Let's prepare. Receive the signals for the three Ashtangi temples within the Ilias system. We will now be able to locate the temples with our probes. New objective, this is the way. Here we go again. Professor's team will visit different Ashtangi settlements and learn more about their technology. Agora has offered to have them accompanied by some of the Ashtangi's most efficient researchers. Study Ashtangi technology. Of course we do that. Population transfer complete. Right, that's good, that's good. Okay, getting, getting closer to things. What 
are you waiting for? Okay, there's just a couple of uh, alloys missing. Temple of free will. Okay, here we go. Um. Okay, I think we need more science ships, maybe? But I don't know if we can get them ready in the amount of time. Okay, but we need two of them to collect all that stuff. Deliver it to the project. A science ship team has completed a task. Let's bring it over there. technology is greatly influenced by its terrestrial heritage, often involves some form of genetic manipulation. Oxen are used to fertilize their fields, with chails adapted for plowing. These produce fruits of considerable size, the bark serving as food for other giant ophid-like creatures. Ishtingit buildings are made from cut stone blocks and a fungus that shapes and strengthens the structure over time. The scientists pointed out that Watchbirds serve as lookouts and communicate in ultrasound. We've completed a detailed report that contains the knowledge of the Ashtangit shared with us. Okay, that's awesome. So let's grab all that and hopefully build enough batteries. Okay, we need to build batteries, that's for sure. Oh, we need repairs there, okay. Right. Something. Oh, right now we finally delivered a Numitor. Maybe we can finish that then. Okay, we'll get there. A science ship team has completed a task. After several surveys, the team of the Tesla discovered the existence of a second, much smaller and dense core of Numitor. self small space particles were also detected, and the team proposes that there is a correlation between the presence of these particles and the core's strong geothermal activity. Alright, okay, so we got that done. Temple of Merit, okay. Treat the blueprint fragment from the Temple of Common Sense. Temple of Free Will. Find the Temple of Merit. Okay, oh yeah. Alright, let's go. Research everything we can. Science ship. Okay, yeah. Speed up those as well. I think that will be good. It's moving, is it? Oh yeah, it was on the first ring when it started. 
Shoot. Really have to speed up now. Okay, actually doing things now. That's good. We got that delivered. Okay, you're building there. Right. Uh, I think we got all those done. Okay, there's the battery space here. Maintenance. Let's keep those up and building. Might there be to find? Common sense temple of merit. Okay, there it is. All right, we got it. Um, and they got it as well. Wait, no, it wasn't six, right? An accident has occurred in the Tycoon. Okay, let's head out there. Um, a science ship team has completed a task. There you go. Diamonds are forever. Large quantities of data have been sent by the team of Lupacol. They have identified the presence of froze tycoons on the planet, and the reports contain a great excitement about potential new discoveries. We'll jump theory and Frost's work on matter and dilution. However, we've received a concerning message from the infrastructure's dedicated PA warning that the team's behavior is becoming unusual. Dolo security protocols recommend an immediate conclusion to the mission. Continue with extraction analysis. The Einstein's team will continue to work until they arrive at a satisfying conclusion. Go for it, guys. Go for it. Just need everything we can get. A science ship has arrived at its destination. Temple of Common Sense. Oh wow, what is happening? The probe has found the Shingi Temple of Common Sense. It has manifested its presence so that we could locate it, emitting weak electromagnetic signals. It still appears to be powered and functional despite its tilted axis. This is the sensitive team. Yeah. Okay, that's a funny name. We have docked at the Temple of Common Sense. <laughs> this could be a joke. <laughs> Came across an inscription winding around the Temple of Column. It was written in several languages. We enclose here the illusion of common sense, the moral habit, the origins lost, and the darkness of the minds that wield it. The scientific method has repeatedly shown how counterintuitive reality is. We must strip common sense away, leaving only empathy and pragmatism in their purest forms. These two modes will then find their rightful place. We have located the room where one of the three parts of the plan for the bioengineering center is stored. The temple's rooms contain objects and testimonies left by people who have become cognizant to common sense and its bias. Temple's rooms are large and filled with objects of all kinds and sizes. It will take time for the sensitive team to investigate. We'll try it anyway. Remus. Which one is it? A probe has completed its head out there. Okay, you should be done anytime soon. We send you over to Temple of Merit. You're done as well, so let's go there. Okay, let's head out there. Tesla's done, okay, let's move out. Right, and again, we're not searching anything. Damn it. A 
science ship has arrived at its destination. The Green Comet, Vulcan. There are numerous electromagnetic disturbances on the surface of the Comet Vulcan. First visual capture the comet's vibrant green tail. This is the team of the professor. We have landed on Vulcan. Proximity and analysis indicate that the comet is shredding large amounts of boron. Significant electromagnetic disturbances have also been detected. They appear to be similar in nature to those that were observed on the Rakatensky comet in the Morton system. Study the electromagnetic disturbances. Prove the professor will attempt to locate the source of electromagnetic disturbances. Let's do that. A science ship team has completed a task. A probe has completed its scan. Oh. Christ almighty. Crew of the sensitive have decided to remove their helmets and die in the Temple of Common Sense. They say that space is no place for humanity. They refuse to become Ashtangites, who they call in the reports neurasthenic geraniums. According to them, ending themselves there and then was the only thing to do. Sensitive will be sent back to the tycoon via its autopilot. Oh no. Oh no. A science ship team has completed a task. Not funny. At some point within its lifespan, Lupercal was exposed to strong gravitational and electromagnetic forces, as well as nuclear radiation. The team has put forward two explanatory theories. First identifies Ilya's transformation into a white dwarf as the cause of this exposure. The second derives from the works of Frost and Borgerville. It possesses that the existence of one or more entities within self-similar space. Entities that could or may interact with our material plane would result in aberrations in the fundamental forces of nature. On the cusp of true discovery, the team has requested further time be invested into the studies on the call. Achieve the final outcome of the Lupacol analysis. Alright, bring me some answers. Here's the eyes of the earth is coming back, right? Maximum drone capacity. Oh, yeah. A science ship has arrived at its destination. Science ship team right? has completed okay. a task. Out there again. We venture down to the crevasse of Vulcan, seeking the source of electromagnetic disturbances. Entering a small cave full of luminous and boron crystals, we stop to take readings. The results remain consistent. Proceeding further in, we found a large floaty gray sphere, similar to the one located on Cruise P43. Noticed a growing fascination for the sphere among the other expedition members. They better not touch it. It's mine. The crew of the professor will study the sphere while under strict psychological surveillance. Okay, now let's go for that. We found the Temple of Merit, which has manifested its presence so that our senses could locate it. Structures emitting weak electromagnetic signals. Are barely perceptible. Despite the fact it appears abandoned, the temple is still powered. This is the Tesla team. We have docked at the Temple of Mary. We saw an inscription written in several languages in one of the temple wards. We enclose here the illusion of merit. This chimera, draped in logic, has never ceased to be a tool for those who began their lives more powerful than others. Merit is an inverted reflection that judges without understanding origin. This illusion confuses explanation, excuse and therefore prevents one from inhabiting reality. Following the instruction of the Ashtangites, we have located one of the three parts of the bioengineering center blueprint. Their offerings and messages here left by people 
kind of let go of merit and found balance. Let's do another study or if that goes wrong then we get the hell out of there. No second A science one. ship has arrived at its destination. Okay, you head over there. Treat the fragment and leave. Oh yeah. Let's do that. Iron left to be found somewhere. An accident has occurred in the typhoon. Okay, that's a lot of crew members. Bad, bad situation. Task. Team has retrieved the fragment and board the sensitive. Okay, we got that done. Now, let's figure it out. Oh, wow, okay, here we go. Diamonds are forever. We are no longer receiving transmission from Lionstein's team. Behavioral analysis of their final communications identified signs of unhealthy fascination and self destructive tendencies. Before indicating what they refer to as the Descent to Other Gods, the team transmitted a final packet of study data. <sighs> Repatriate Einstein. Okay. A probe has completed its scan. A science ship team has completed a task. Oh no, not again. The team discovered an object that apparently contains all the technological knowledge and theories of the Ashtakis. Reportedly, this knowledge will change our accepted understanding of reality. We will never know, as the crew appear to have killed each other, fighting over who should be credited with the discovery. Tesla will be sent back to the tycoon via its autopilot. Oh no, another five people down there. That's bad. By applying preventative monitoring protocols, the team of the professor were able to counter any perceived negative impact from the sphere, successfully sending several measuring devices into the sphere itself. The team was able to collect a large number of unusually precise data sets. Let's get out there, collect that. Can't lose another one. Okay, Noble goes over there. We are sensitive. Sensitive heads over there. A science ship has arrived at its destination. Temple of Free Will. Since I've located the Ashtangi Temple of Free Will, the structure emits weak electromagnetic signals that are barely perceptible despite its dilapidated state. The temple is still powered. This is the Noble Team. We have docked at the Temple of Free Will. There is an inscription in the temple's interior corridor written in several languages. Here we lock up the illusion of free will. This fictional narrative prevents us from seeing where we are and what we can do. There is no choice, because the motivations that led us to choose pre-existed the choice. Following the direction of the Ishtangitis, we located the room where one of the three parts of the bioengineering center's blueprint is stored. The temple contains many objects and testimonies from people who enjoy liberated from free will. Treat the fragment and leave. Don't want to waste any more time for that. There's some iron, that's cool. Ship team has completed attacks. Happy New Year, Administrator. <laughs> okay. Wouldn't all be. Oh, there it is. Five of five.
Okay, we need to head down there. So which one is here? The Einstein. Where's the Einstein? Oh, it is it is already back in action. Okay, let's move out there. Go, go, go. Team has retrieved the fragment and boarded the noble. Alright. Uh back to Tycoon, I guess. batteries then. Okay, we're using alloy all over. So they should work. Okay, what's going on here? Collecting stuff and collecting stuff as well. Where's the Tesla? Okay, the Tesla is done. A science ship has oh, arrived at its destination. Treat the fragment. Let's get the hell out of there. Should head over there. Wait a minute. Um, 3.9 cycles. A science ship team has completed a task. Team has retrieved the fragment and boarded the Einstein. Alright, we got everything. The great transformation. Construct the bioengineering center. Do we need to search that first? Gotta be kidding. Um, can we stop that maybe? 
<laughs> no wait, there's that one. Damn it, I forgot about it. This is madness. A probe has completed its scan. Okay, well, um, it doesn't matter, does it? Shit. Ah, uh, well, that's bad, right? Christ almighty, where the deck came from. Take over the whole sector. Oh, my Lord. Has completed its scan. Well, we got an alloy, that's for sure. Okay, well, we're getting there. What's about the fire in sector two? Oh no! Oh no! 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 What's happening? They can 
control it later. Okay, where's Noble? Okay, so it's sensitive. Sensitive and professor, okay. Get built. Come on. signs left there so Well, at least that one is building. Oh, yeah, the large one. Okay, nice. Population transfer complete. Wow, okay, they finally built it. That's awesome. Proof condition rumors over the course of 10 cycles. What else is there to do? Right, the last stand. Um, wait, so that means we need to has occurred in the tycoon. Uh, build batteries, I guess. So let's get the hell going here. We do need some more. Still workers. Let's run the 
icons. Okay, what is happening here? Uh, things are getting out of hand here, kind of. It's for me to grasp. Population transfer complete. Okay. Oh, it's getting closer. Oh no, 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 going on there. Okay, so you've been built. Alright, there's another sector where we could build something. Done now. Come on, everybody. There, build. Build, build, build. Our workforce gone now. Okay, they simply get <laughs> simply got distracted by, by the 
process. Okay, I got it. Uh, right. Waste then. has completed its scan. Fifty-nine percent and counting. that sector four. Oh yeah, but they're building. Yeah, high priority then. Come on, charge. 92%. has completed its scan. This one arrives over here. Okay, please go to work then. An accident has occurred in the typhoon. Center. Greatest required to unlock this. Oh, you probably need the DLS for that, right? Okay, who cares? 98. Where's the Pyrenees? Oh, it's getting closer. It's getting closer. One hour. Final push. has completed its scan.
come on, one more, one more. A probe has completed its scan. Okay, there it is, 100%. Oh, please tell me I missed something. Oh, no, I didn't. There's nothing more to do. Where are you about to land it? It wouldn't let me, right? It wouldn't let me. Did everything I could. There we go. Okay, we got it. Alright, everyone. Let's join the Ashtangitis on Ramos. Don't worry about happening now. This leads to the end of the game. Proceed. Well, I guess so. Okay, what happens now? to this message, it means the tycoon has reached its destination, despite the unpredictable parameters that framed the equation of its journey. The crew have found a new home, whether the one planned for or another. These survivors have already begun to lay the foundations of a new cradle, where creativity Invention and joy can bloom again. Perhaps you already understand why I insisted. Why the mission launch was precipitated. When I discovered that the lunaclism was inevitable, I also understood that any attempt to save our species after this would have been doomed to fail. You took the helm in the only launch window available to us. Thanks to you, our efforts, our mistakes, our sins and sacrifices will sink into oblivion, into the past, while the first pages are written for a newly born humanity.